Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. I'm gonna be taking you guys into Aldi today. They are having an amazing sell today. So much is happening in their store. They're having a lot of Hispanic items for Cinco de Mayo, which is coming up May 5th, I believe. They're also having some garden stuff that I wanna get my hands on. They're having tons there. So I wanna take you guys down the aisles. I wanna share with you everything they have new this week. So my sale starts Wednesday. Day, so I'm filming this video on Wednesday and the sale goes from a Wednesday to Sunday so if you see anything that you like definitely head to all the ASAP because the amazing home items and food items go so fast so let's head into the store Gosh, there is a freaking line you guys do you see all of those people Wow okay Okay guys, we are headed right into Aldi. I tried to start on the home aisle, but you guys, it was packed with so many people. So I'm going to start with the food first. A lot of you guys had told me those garlic knots are very good. They also have an entire aisle of just cookies. These are like Girl Scout cookie dupes, and I've tried a few of them and they are pretty good. So I wanted to share these with you guys, and they're pretty much $1.49 for most of them. Some of them are a little bit more, and then these are the cookies that I raved about in my last video. The cookie thins, they have chocolate chip, they have lemon, key lime, and they also have a coconut one which wasn't there, but they did have these coconut macaroons and those are amazing. This was the first time that I saw this hummus at Aldi, so I wanted to share it with you guys. It had four different flavors. This would be perfect if you're entertaining, so that way there's so much for people to choose from. I love hummus. They had the spinach artichoke dip for $2.95. They had so much selections for a barbecue, like cold slaw, potato salad, and those were only $2.29. I had to highlight the famous Aldi lemonade that I'm raving about. They had just got some new cases of it, so I picked up a couple of those as well. And with Cinco de Mayo, being here in just a few days. I wanted to highlight the Hispanic aisle at Aldi. They have so much to pick from. And if you guys have not tried this pesto, it is so good. So I decided to share the meats that I don't usually see at Aldi. My Aldi never has ground chicken and they never have these patties like that that were 10 for $10. They had the beef on sale, so I wanted to share that with you guys. They had tons of meat that I've never seen before. Aldi has an amazing freezer aisle and they have so many good picks. The frozen pizzas I've heard are really good. They had a Mexican style chicken fajita, a taco season one for only $3.99. I wanted to share with you guys those Chick-fil-A sandwich dupes so where you can find them in the red bag. Make sure you pick those up. I wanted to share those mussels because I picked those up my last trip and they were delicious. They had some salmon burgers for $4.99. I have not tried those. Let me know if you've tried them. They had ahi tuna steaks for $4.69 and they had so many different potatoes and hash browns you can pick from. I have never tried their like skillet hash browns, these shredded ones, so I want to try those. Those were $1.75. I always stock up on my frozen veggies every time I go to Aldi because they have the best prices in town. They had some empanadas, they had some chicken ones, they had some beef ones. Those are a must pick up for sure, you guys. I picked up the chicken ones and you'll hear how I feel about those very soon. They also had these chicken fajitas that has everything you need in the kit already done for you. They had these churros. These are gonna go super fast. They had three different kinds you can choose from. An apple one, one that had like a cream filling inside, and then just also the traditional like cinnamon sugar. And they had these little chicken bites. Some had carne asada, some had chicken in them. They looked very good. Let me know know if you guys picked those up. Those were $4.79. And they also had these taco kits for $9.99. You guys, you get everything you need in the kit, the seasoning, the tortillas, the meat. They had a Chipotle shrimp one. They also had a Baja fish one and they had a carnitas one as well. Ooh. 
Let me know if you guys have tried all these pre-mixed margarita. It's only $13.99. I was excited to see these chips. These are new for this week only. They had a queso flavored one and also a taco flavored chip. That sounds fun. I didn't pick those up, but I feel like that would be really good for a kid. They also had these seasoning packets, all different variations of seasonings. I got two of each and they also had this little seasoning guy as well that had every seasoning you would need to have the perfect Mexican night. Had to wait for the home aisle to clear out so a lot of things were picked over so I couldn't share it with you guys in its full form but that's okay they had those guacamole chips for $1.99 they also had those cheese ones as well the garden beds is what I was most excited about down the home aisle only $49.99 they had that beautiful iron like garden gate as well look at these plant brackets you guys those are such a good deal Those empty boxes I just shared with you guys were all of the beautiful wooden welcome signs. Literally, my store had three boxes of them and every single person had one in their cart. Luckily, that was not on my list to pick up, but if you want a welcome sign, you need to get to Aldi ASAP. They had these outdoor trash cans for $39.99 and tons of plant stands. I'm also about to share with you guys some different variations of some like bird feeders. This would be so fun to have outside if you have like a porch and watch the birds feed that would be really fun and these solar lights I thought about getting these to line our driveway I'm not sure if I'm going to go back for those or not but that was a really good price on the solar lights So my Aldi only gets the Health Aid kombucha around the spring and summer, so I wanted to share that. That's a very good brand of kombucha. They had different flavors that you can pick from. The cotton candy grapes, you guys, they only bring around the summer and springtime. Those were only $3.99. A lot of people have raved about these stuffed mushrooms, so let me know if you've tried those before. And those rose cones, I wish I would have gotten those because I'm looking at them and I'm like, man, that looks so good. And they also had some dairy-free ice cream that I want to try one day. And they had a few more frozen items that I didn't share with you guys. They had these like little chicken fajita skillets and they also had some frozen corn as well. Hey guys, we just got back in the car from Aldi and the store was insane. It was the busiest I've seen it since they had the advent calendars around Christmas time. There were so many people in Aldi. I kind of had to hang around till about 920 so I can get some footage for you guys. And by that time, everything was like cleared out Everyone came for those welcome signs that was down the home aisle at Aldi. Those were completely gone the time I got down there. There was probably like 50 of them and all of them were gone. A lot of people had the raised garden beds in their cart. A lot of people had a lot of the Hispanic like food items. All of the food items stayed. So if you are in the market for some really good Hispanic food, you will definitely be able to get your hands on it. If you are more in the market for home stuff, you need to get into Aldi ASAP. This sale is incredible this week. There's so so many good things but anyway my trunk is full of groceries full of things I want to do a big haul when I get home so I'll see you guys when I get home I told you guys in the car all they had so many amazing things on sale this week they had amazing stuff in the freezer aisle and my favorite thing about the food items is that they don't go fast so if you see any of these food items that you like, most likely you'll be able to get your hands on them. The home items, you kind of have to get into Aldi as soon as possible because those go so fast and then they don't start the next sale till next week. So definitely get in there if you see some home items you guys like, but let's start with the frozen stuff first. Right, starting with the frozen stuff, I picked up two packs of these ground turkey for recipes. These are two and a half pounds. So I love picking these up if I'm gonna make like homemade burgers. I can make tons of patties and then just freeze whatever ones we don't use. These are great for tacos, things like that. So two packs of some ground turkey. I also picked up a pack of this Italian sausage. I use this in my tortellini soup. I've shared that recipe with you guys in my what I eat in a week video and it's just so good. So I always like to have Italian sausage on hand and Aldi has the best prices on the Italian sausage. So definitely pick it up from there. I also picked up tons of ground chicken. So ground chicken, I don't know about you guys, but ground chicken is so hard for me to find. It's like never at any grocery stores. I know for sure it's never at Aldi. This was the first week that I've seen it at Aldi since last year. I don't know if it's just like a spring and summer find, but in 
anyway, I picked up five pounds of ground chicken just because it's so hard to find. And like other grocery stores, it's so expensive. I don't remember the pricing of this, but I definitely shared it with you guys in the store. And ground chicken is just so good for so many recipes. Anything you would use like ground turkey or ground beef for, you can use ground chicken for. And I just love the way it tastes. So anyway, I picked up five packs of this. We do have a deep freezer, so that's how I'm able to like bulk buy meat and just kind of keep it in there. And when we need it, we can just defrost it. Next up, I'm super excited about this chicken fajita skillet pack. So this has the meat already in here. It has the white meat chicken, onions, and bell peppers. It also has flour tortillas already in the bag, you guys. And it has the spicy fajita seasoning packet. So everything you need is in this bag. You get six tortillas. It cooks in a skillet in 14 and a half minutes. You also has a way you can microwave it as well. I'm gonna cook mine in a skillet. This is going to be so good for a quick and easy dinner. I have another chicken fajitas that I shared with you guys before, but I really wanted to try this one because I've never tried this one before. So um, definitely pick you up this because quick and easy dinners are so great on busy weekdays. I also picked up, again, to go in the deep freezer, just two packs of bacon. So many of my recipes call for bacon, so it's really good to have on hand. I don't know if you guys can see these two massive packs of beef. I do make homemade dog food for my dogs, so I pick up tons of meat. As you can see, some is for me, some is for the dogs, but this meat is five pounds. It is a lot higher in fat than I would like it to be, so what I'm gonna do is just cook it and drain it because I don't want my dogs having that much grease. So this one is 73% lean, 27% fat, so definitely higher in fat than I'd like. So you're definitely gonna need to drain this if you are following my homemade dog food recipe. I will make sure to tag that above in case you don't know what I'm talking about. And then I also picked up these churros, which are new for this week only. You guys, I'm so excited about it. They had three different types. They had one filled with apple, one filled with cream, and these are just the original cinnamon sugar churros. You get 20 of them. They look delicious, but they're not the healthiest. So I got one box and I thought this would be so, so fun to have on Secret de Mayo, which is coming up very soon. Next item, Ryan picked these up. He actually came to Aldi with me today, which he never comes with me. So he was excited about all of the finds as well. He added these m and vanilla, um, ice cream cookies to the cart. And Aldi has these all the time, by the way. If you are into desserts, they have so many different things you can choose from. They have those rose cones I shared with you guys in store, but he wanted these m and sandwiches. So pick those up. Tons of frozen vegetables, frozen broccoli. We picked up this, um, is it called Elette? Please help me out. It's E-L-O-T-E -E style corn, and it's just Mexican corn. It's fire roasted, super sweet corn with cottage cheese, uh, monetary jack cheese, and a chili spice. That looks delicious. So this is, again, a lot of the Hispanic food they had this week. It's going to go, you guys. It won't be at Aldi forever, so definitely pick some up. They had another variation that had like corn, I think tomatoes, and black beans, but I really wanted to try this one. Got frozen broccoli, got like a mixed vegetable mix, got some frozen green beans, got tons of those bags for us, for our dogs. I pop them in their homemade dog food, so they're perfect. I also got these mini empanadas in the chicken flavor. They also had a beef one, and they also had another one as well. I can't remember, but this looked really good. Again, this is one of the items that they brought this week, so it's not going to last an Aldi, so pick this up, and I'm going to see if it's good. If it's good, I may go back and get some more. And then while we're over here, I picked up tons of these seasoning packs. Mind you, Aldi never has these exact seasoning packs. They just brought them for this week. So I got two of each one. I got one Southwest Ranch Chicken for street tacos. That looked really good. I got a carne asada one. And then I also got a Baja fish one. I was gonna get their taco kits that already had like the seasoning pack in it, but I wanted to make them myself. So I just picked up two of each one of these little seasoning packs and they were only 69 cents you guys. So that's such a good deal. So I'm excited to hook up some Mexican knives with these seasoning packs. All right, I'm gonna get all of the freezer stuff put away and then we're gonna move over to some of the dry ingredients and also the home items. All right, I put all of the freezer stuff away. Now we are on to the rest of the items I'm gonna share with you guys. 
First up, I wanted to share this sparkling pink lemonade. I just filmed a video last week sharing my top 10 things to buy at Aldi. If you guys missed that video, I will tag it above. It is an amazing video and I share the best items you get at Aldi. This was definitely my number one purchase. So how to pick up some more of this because I'm gonna be drinking this all spring and summer. It is so good. I also picked up two bags of sweet potatoes. We go through these a lot. Use these in my homemade dog food. We eat sweet potatoes, so two bags of these. And then, oh, I have a bag of frozen veggies that I need to pop in the freezer. Don't know how that got over here. I picked up this kombucha. I really like this kombucha by Health Aid. This one is a pink lady apple. I only picked up one because I wanted to make sure I like it. I usually only get the pomegranate one from this brand, so didn't want to pick up a ton and then not like it because this is $3 for one bottle. Kombucha can be very pricey. So before I buy a lot, I need to try it first. So this one is the Pink Lady Apple, like I said, and I love this kombucha. It is so good. If you guys have never had a kombucha, definitely give it a try. I love it. And then I picked up two avocados. These are rock hard, but I wanna make some um, guacamole this weekend. So I picked up two of these and just two bananas because we already have quite a bit of bananas over there. We have four bananas. And I just wanted two more for the weekend because I want to make my banana pancakes. I'm actually probably going to make some banana pancakes when I'm done filming this video. So I didn't want to pick up too much and they go bad. So I just picked up two more. And then we needed some more flour tortillas to do some taco nights. So pick this up. And then I also picked up this plain whole milk Greek yogurt. I actually give this to my dogs. You guys will see that in an upcoming video of how I give it to my dogs, but they love this yogurt. I like it too for my parfaits, but the dogs love it more than I do. So always pick up a container of this when I go to Aldi. And then I picked up some of these Clancy white round tortilla chips. They are very good just to dip guacamole in and all that good stuff. And then these kettle chips. Um, Ryan loves these. He says they taste better than the Lay's one. So just like the plain kettle chips by Lay's, he likes the Clancy's version better. So picked up some of these. And then I wanted to get this sweatshirt. I thought it was so soft. I got it in an extra large because I want it to be a very oversized and cover my butt when I'm wearing leggings. And it's just this beautiful like green color. Um, so they had it in a purple color, which I already have that one, but I didn't get it from all you got from TJ Maxx. They had a gray color, a black color. Some had hoods, some did not. Mine's had a hood on it. I didn't really want a hood, but um, this color only came in one with a hood. So I ended up getting this one, and I think it was $12.99, or maybe it was $8.99. I don't remember the price of this, but definitely very affordable for a sweatshirt. And then also, I am so excited about these items. So I picked up two pair of PJs. If you guys are new around here, I love PJs. Usually I get all my pajamas from Target, but I have like five or six pairs of pajamas that I've collected over the years from Aldi and they're always great quality. So I picked up some more. I got this loungewear set. It's just like a little two piece set. Let me see if I can take it out. When I got both of these in a medium, that's usually the size I am in Aldi. This is connected, but here are the shorts. They just have this little elastic on them and they're this beautiful like lush pink and green color. I love these. And then it has just like a little button up shirt to go with it. This is gonna be so cute, I love that. And then I also got, this is the one I'm most excited about and it's the avocado pajama set. I got it in a size medium and let's see. So let me cut the tag off of that. So you just get these pajama pants that have avocados on them. Do you guys see that? How cute are these? I'm gonna come closer to the camera so you can really see. So this is the print on them. They're just avocados and you can see how roomy these mediums are. So definitely um, they're still gonna give me a very relaxed fit in the mediums. I love that print. And then here is the little shirt to go with it. How cute is that you guys? This was my most exciting purchase from Aldi today. So love these guys. I can't wait to put these on. So now I'm gonna take you guys out in the garage and share with you something else I'm super excited about. The item I picked up is what I shared with you guys in store and it is this wooden raised garden bed. I already have two garden beds in my backyard, but I don't have one that's raised like this on legs. And it was only $50, you guys. And I just started my garden a few weeks ago, maybe three or four weeks ago. And so now I'm wanting to add a little bit more to my garden. I wanna do like some rosemary and I wanna do a few 
few other things and I'm out of space in my current garden. So pick this up. I also picked up one for my mom as well for Mother's Day. Mother's Day is coming up, you guys. So definitely go shopping for your moms now while you still have time. So I picked up two of these guys and then also picked up two packs of this garden soil. And you need two bags of this, When at least when I read the back of this, it tells you how much liters of dirt you need or soil. And so I think two bags is going to be enough. And it says it feeds up to four months and it's garden soil. So I think I'm going to probably set this up today and probably get all of like the fresh herbs that I'm gonna be using this weekend from Lowe's. Um, in my garden right now, I use seeds, but I want to just like buy the live plant this time around. So that way I can harvest right away. I'm being impatient because it's just taking so long with the seeds, but yeah, I'm so excited about it. They had two colors. They had this kind of like light pine color and they also had like an aged gray color, which is beautiful too. But for $50, you seriously can't beat that. Still mine at this dirty mirror. I'm sorry about the lighting in here. I'm getting ready to edit this video right now, but I had to share with you guys these avocado pajamas because they are so comfy and cozy for $12.99 to get these adorable pajamas. Oh my gosh. So this is the medium and you can see they fit me perfectly. Still kind of give me that relaxed look. I definitely could have gotten a large if I wanted it to be a little bit more baggy, but I think these fit really, really good. I am so excited about these PJs for $12.99. And if you guys didn't know, I have an obsession with avocados. I love them. So these are so perfect. But anyway, just had to share that. I'm about to get this video edited and I'll see you guys soon. Look at this cute little um, AirPod case that my sister-in-law got me. It's a little avocado. I have such a love for avocados. So she bought this for me. That was so sweet. And now it matches my cute little PJs. I thought I was done sharing this haul with you guys. I just heated these up in the air fryer for about 10 minutes and I did five minutes, flipped them in the nether five minutes. They are delicious, you guys. So, so good. Definitely pick these up if you go to Aldi for sure. Okay, guys, that completes all of the new and exciting things that's at Aldi this week. I did not plan to have two Aldi videos back to back on my channel, but when I saw the sale for this week, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to cover this sale because it is just the best sale I've seen in several months now. We haven't had a sale this good at Aldi since last year, so I had to cover it, but I will make sure to leave my top 10 things to pick up at Aldi down below. If you guys have not checked out that video, definitely check that out before you go to Aldi. Let me know it down below what you're going to be adding to your shopping list this week and I'm going to put those avocado PJs on and I'm about to go sit at my computer get this video edited and uploaded today because the sale starts on Wednesday I want you guys to be able to see this video the same day the sale starts so that way if you see anything you like anything you love you can head to Aldi right away and pick it up because the good stuff goes fast but I'll see you guys in my next one bye